Good evening. Welcome on in to the evening edition of From Day One. Tonight, courtesy of our good friend over at Frauditor Troll, we have a Frauditor who's going to get arrested for the sixth time. Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six times in just one year. Let's begin. All right, starts looking at stupid signs. Pulling down a back to school backpack. Oh, that's sign. over. That's over. That's over. You're stupid. This is coming up. Community Resource Fair. Maria Hernandez Park. For more info, call 718443. Looking at every sign in the facility, are we? Why, it ain't like you know how to read. Yeah, by the way, the background noise is his. And he's thinking this is like some Hello. evil. Hello. You're not allowed to be recording in this facility. Why is that? Look, right here. Because they told you. That's my There's bad. There's a sign. What's this sign mean? It means stop fucking recording. Like, I have no problem with that. Just yeah. record here. Um, is that a is that a law or a policy? Am I breaking a law? Um, this is our law and procedures. This is our policy for the precinct. Uh, okay, you, said policy. Policy. Law, you said policy. You said policy. The idiot's right gonna to be, be here. I'm asking you and I okay. stop recording. You can take everything. I have can no you problem. Do you said you said can policy. Can you give me a card and three CCRB complaint forms? Sure, no problem. Thank give you. me one second. Yeah, he's going to want to complain on you because you told him to turn off his little uh, Sir, Sergeant, Mackenzie you potato. Yeah, stop recording. I need you to exit. Hi, Sergeant. Sir, stop recording. Are you asking me to leave? Yes, 100%. Okay. If you don't leave, you will be trespassed. You got to give you me an opportunity to leave, No, right? leave now. This you is the opportunity. Request, you want, you inside, Why is that? Because they told you to. Right there, you all you want. Why can't I record in there? Because we said so. That's why. So oh, that's yeah. Yeah, I need your card. There you go. So that's good. One six two. I don't have a card available. You gotta write if you it would down. like, I can write it right there for you. Of course. This clown knows very well that he's not allowed to record in there. I don't know why he's pushing his luck yet again. You'll see later on in the video when he gets released from jail, he's trying to get this viral video. But the sad reality for Creepy David is that none of his videos go viral. Yes, he has a bunch of shorts with a lot of views, but so does everybody else and their uncle. Getting short views on YouTube is extremely easy and all those subscribers that come from the shorts don't translate into actual subscribers that watch your long form content. And that's why when you look at his channel, yes, on paper, he has 58,000 subscribers, but he's not even able to get 10,000 views on an arrest video. Meanwhile, this video that you're watching now is very likely to get 10,000 views in the Easy. first couple hours. So yeah, Creepy David, I don't think this is gonna work out for you. Write it down. Can you just stop blocking yeah. the grocery? Uh, I'm talking, I'm conducting business. No, you can't. Back up. Don't you block the, the, you don't have to the, touch me, bro. Relax. De-escalate, they didn't teach you de-escalate? You a sergeant, they don't teach you de-escalate? Here you go, sir. Don't come back. Is that a policy? Don't, 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 don't tell me what to do. Don't tell me what to do, I'm not breaking the law. You will be arrested. And do not block the Give me my CCRB complaint forms, thank you. Do your job, thank you. Do your job, thank you. Goodbye. Fucking tyrant. You don't take your job seriously, Sergeant? Sir, 
one more time, or you will be arrested. If you block that one more Arrested time, for what? Arrested. I'm waiting for my paperwork. Relax, bro. Move Let me talk to your lieutenant. Move to the left. Let me talk to your lieutenant. Move to the left. Thank you, sir. Let me speak to your lieutenant. Get your lieutenant, by the way. No, Get your lieutenant, you because you don't know what you're doing. Give me your lieutenant. You see this shit? Yeah, I see you're stupid. That's because they don't give a fuck about CCRBs. What's his name? Because he fucking scribbled his name. What's his name? Um, Sergeant Askazubi. Askazubi? How do you spell that? A-S-C-A-Z-U-B-I. So what law is it that I can't record in there? You can't actually record inside this facility. I'm asking you what law is it? What law am I breaking? I'm not here to argue with you. Of course, because you can't argue because there is no law, ma'am. I need to speak to his lieutenant because he's out of control. Our Sergeant right now? There has to be a lieutenant. You didn't even write your name down properly. Hey, for what? I need your ID. You mean for what? What crime do you suspect me of? Give me your ID. Are you refusing to? You're refusing to provide ID. Ninety-two Charlie. What crime do you suspect me of? All right. So he got arrested, but don't go anywhere. The best is yet to come, as he is about to cry an e-bag for lawyer fees. Yeah, what up? Again, bro. Niggas got me again. Hey, watch that word. I got released this morning at like fucking 12.30, 1 o'clock. I just got my phone back. Trespassing from a public place, they got me with disorderly. Trespassing in the third degree and obstruction. All for standing on a sidewalk recording. You weren't on the sidewalk. You went in the so, building. What's up, everybody? Niggas hey. arresting me on the sidewalk Watch for trespassing, and obst obstruction, and disorderly conduct. And then they took my phone. I went back to the precinct last night. They said my phone was going to be there for 30 days. I went back to the precinct. They said that um, I got to get the ADA to release it. I got the ADA to release it. They said, oh, you got to wait till 4 o'clock until your officer... Until your officer releases the... Um, your arresting officer has to release the property to you. I said, nah, just give me my phone. Like, does it matter who gives me my phone? Then he comes out with a paper and says, your phone isn't here. Your phone is at the property clerk. The property clerk closes at 2 p.m. So imagine if I would have waited till 4 p.m., I would have never got my phone back today. And then I'm looking at the paperwork and on the description, the 83rd precinct in Brooklyn. And then in the description of my phone, it says my phone is cracked and scratched and chipped. What? My phone is brand new. Oh boy, now he's gonna say that the cops damaged his flip phone. It's okay, Creepy David. Just go back to Toys R Us and buy another one. Why in the description does it say that my phone is scratched and chipped and cracked? So I'm on my way over here to the fucking 
property clerk in Brooklyn. Like, yo, I hope my phone isn't broken. I hope these niggas didn't. First of all, you arrested me because of your ego. Because I wasn't committing no crime. Yes, you were. You arrested me because of your ego. And no. then you're going to break my phone on top of that? You sent me to the bookings. You added three charges for nothing. And then you break my phone on top of that? Yes. Yeah, any any donation is greatly appreciated right now. Like, honestly. I don't want to. I'm not trying to e-bag, but I appreciate anything you guys send my way. Definitely sounds my like cash app, my PayPal, or yeah. Apple Pay. Yeah, and if you have me on Facebook, you send me there as bigger. well. But um, so I get here, I get my phone. My phone is in brand new condition. Thank God, cause I would have been like, I'm, I'm already suing these niggas, but I would have added that to the hey, lawsuit. Hey, like, break my work? phone on top of that. That shit is crazy, bro. You gotta learn English. Nah, bro. they didn't break my phone. Thank God, man. My phone is still brand new. It just doesn't have a case. They gave me my case back. Why would you give me my case? Why not keep the case on the phone? I said, yo, I should have went live. So I got released from the bookings. The judge at the bookings dismissed the case, gave me an ACD. I didn't want to take the ACD. But if I didn't take the ACD, I would never got my phone back today. I would have had to wait until whenever the case was dismissed. How the fuck am I going to stay out of trouble for six months when I don't commit crimes and I've been arrested six times since January? Stop since Martin Luther King Day, I've been arrested six times. This is the oh. sixth time I've been arrested for nothing. For everything. Because of motherfuckers' egos. I'm already nice. Now I got to even be even nicer so that these motherfuckers' egos won't get hurt. So that they want to arrest me for no reason? For many Whatever reasons. Whatever you do, do not call that precinct. Oh boy. Now he's organizing a call flooding campaign. They should get him for that too. If he stops the government operations over there, that's definitely another charge. And at the same time, Creepy David, six arrests in one year. Like that's pretty sad. That's literally the definition of insanity. You're doing the same thing over and over and you're expecting a different, different result. result. The NYPD is doing a fantastic job this year, mopping the floor with frauditors. How the fuck am I not gonna get arrested for six months? Dealing Easy. with these motherfuckers. Stop breaking the law. For breaking no laws. You broke, Once he has seen this broke video, I want this video to go viral. It ain't. He's like, yeah, um, put me wherever you want. I said, nigga, you're going, you're going fucking global, bro. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna do my best to make sure this video goes viral, bro. You really, you arrested me because of your ego, bro. And I'm telling him, I'm like, yo, de-escalate, de-escalate. Re-escalate, re-escalate. He didn't de-escalate, he was escalating that whole time for no reason. We could have had a good conversation. Straight tyrant, one of the biggest tyrants I ran into so far. You mean straight you? ego, straight ego. You mean you? Then you take my phone. He knew once. He, once he's like, I'm taking his phone. Nigga, I got it back the same day. Nigga, I just got out this morning. Hey, again, watch. Twelve thirty, one o'clock. What time is it? One o'clock. Twelve hours later, I got my phone back. Be mega star. What's up, my brother? Hey. Yeah. He's going viral, bro. He's going viral, bro. I wish I could share that shit here. Share the video here and we can watch it together. But I got to upload this video. The video is 11 minutes long. And for those minutes, I'm walking around filming cars. I wasn't even there for fucking seven minutes and I got arrested. For nothing. For everything. Then this phone is not letting me go live sideways. I don't know if youtube updated or whatever but it's not letting me go live sideways Dude, james williams what are you me? talking about i went to trial only one time and i beat it we i we spoke to lia lia his his lawyers won't take our case you need damages Wyoming, yeah, they're trying to shut me down, but they, they can't stop this movement. 
what the movement of a bunch of weirdo creeping everybody around and harassing people they're yes, doing a really good one. job stopping it because now there's not a damn frauditor that is going to walk in a precinct while recording and victimize the people that are there so good luck with that they are stopping you i'm so happy they didn't break my phone bro it's a brand new fucking phone just stop breaking the law there was no victim and then when I when I speak to the lawyer in the bookings this morning or last night this morning around 12 o'clock she goes who did you piss off the first thing she says to me was who did you piss off I said what do you mean she goes oh you got obstruction the only time I see obstruction is when uh, officers are mad and they just throw it in there I said obstruction they told me just disorderly conduct and trespassing she said yeah you got obstruction I said y'all have record the cops for a living she said oh yeah that makes sense she yeah, said how did you get how we i don't understand how you trespass from public property it's a public building how are you trespass i said with no crime she said i right. then she came back she said i got good news and good news she said the good news is that um they offering you an acd that means they ain't got shit I didn't even see it. This is the first time I seen the judge who already offered me an ACD. I didn't want to take it because how am I going to take it? How am I going to take that? Like, turn this camera around for these niggas be plotting and shit. How am I going to take that? How, am I, how the fuck am I going to stay out of trouble for six months? And. These niggas arrested me for no reason. James Doe, thank you, man. How the fuck am I gonna stay out of trouble for six months? Easy, stop profaning. Stop Somebody, please tell me, how? I'm already a fucking one of the nicest, I'm, I'm already one of the nicest auditors in New York and I'm getting arrested. No, you're not. For literally no reason. So just imagine. Hey, Creepy David, you were asking your audience how you can stay out of trouble for six months? Well, I have an idea. Stop frauditing altogether. That way you'll stay out of trouble, guaranteed. But of course you can't do that because you don't know how to do anything else in life. You have no skills, no talents, and nothing to bring to society. So in your mind, your only option left is to become a parasite, and that's what you do. Correct. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Please like and subscribe. It helps the channel, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Thank you, my man. We definitely appreciate you finding the morons and bringing them. All right, so with that, we will be bringing this day to a close here in just a few seconds. Do one last point here in the great storm. As always, please make sure you do like, share, and subscribe. Help us get to 50,000 views. Uh, 1,000 subscribers. So, Box, you can send us nice red presents. Google can put us on the algorithms. And until tomorrow, like, share, and subscribe. Be kind to one another. And release the Kraken. As we march along this evening and every evening here from day one. Have a great night. We will see you all bright and early tomorrow.